The biggest reason I went off campus was to get an experience outside of Worcester. Ever since like uh, high school, I, I knew I wanted to study off campus. Um, I had gone to Spain for two weeks in high school, and that kind of opened my eyes to like living in a different culture, and I knew I wanted to, to go back and kind of do that more in depth. The application process was actually pretty easy. It was all pretty well lined out for you. They've added something now where it's called uh, Off Campus Study 101. And so that's really helpful because you know you can attend the session you know, as, as early as your first year and really figure out, okay, what are the steps that I need to take to prepare for this? Honestly, a hesitation was that I wasn't going to enjoy it. I decided to choose a program that actually, like, no other Worcester students were going on and I didn't know anybody at all. What really helped me is I was like, I'm just going to take my anxiety and put it in my pocket <laughs> and just face the challenge. And it worked out fine. I attended the Philadelphia Center and the way the program works is that you have two classes but only once a week. The rest of the time you're in a 32 hour week internship working at a job you want to become. So in my case I wanted to become a teacher so I was assigned to school in Philadelphia and got to work with them four out of five days a week. My program was total immersion so all of my courses were in Spanish, my host family only spoke Spanish. Um, and the program directors only spoke to us in Spanish as well. So I was able to actually go to France, Portugal, Barcelona, uh, Italy, and then Hungary. Well, you could, there's so many things you can do. For instance, I took a really cool class called L'Histoire de l'Art. Um, it's like the, um, like the history of Paris and its monuments. You go and actually touch the objects and read about the history of the monuments. I would say do it. Uh, if you can make it happen, um, do.